guys what's good how you doing i hope you are doing well welcome to vinyl tv if you are new to this channel and if you are please consider subscribing and we appreciate it thank you very much indeed for stopping by thank you very much indeed for clicking i want to show you what we got here we got this gear this is hp laser jet m209 dwe this baby right here is multi functional printer you can only print with this printer but you can also scan the document if you connect it with hp smart app and scan the document and send it from here so at the moment i will say that this printer you can only print from this gear but before we go into details about this printer i'm going to turn it around this is the power cable three pin power cable is what we connected here two power cables is included one is three pin and the other one is two pin so depending on the country you reside you just need to choose a particular one okay and this spot here is for ethan cable and this is spot here is for usb cable spot like i mentioned unfortunately the usb cable is not included in the packaging we have this at Vinet text of free delivery here and basically i'm going to show you what the usb cable looks like so the usb cable is universal epson can use it canon can use it hp can use it so you just need to stick the other end inside and this end to the back of your pc and you will recognize it this printer is compatible with mac window and just to make sure it's compatible with window, window 10 mac catalina mac mojavir mac high Sierra. so 1.5 gigabyte high definition internet model device ios and android so basically in terms of this printer it's using ink toner 135a so from the back if you have any paper jam open up this section check for any paper jam and debris this is where to check i do get a lot of questions about paper jam this is where to check and gently close it okay and now turn this print around now this section is for paper okay. so load the particular paper you are using you can load various size up to 150 sheets of paper you can load it here just need to adjust it with the holder okay and once you're done so just need to move it to the side and load particular paper a4 paper four by the various sizes of paper you are using then adjust it to the holder so that you recognize it okay now i use the cover to cover it up you just need to go in okay so you just need to go inside this is how it goes lift it up and load particular paper you just need to protect the paper you are using okay now open up this section here is the toner it's using 135a toner 135a and with inside internet security dynamic you can see the arrow here you just need to go in some toner you, you need to pull stuff out or string that is holding it but this one is already done you just need to go in okay check my video how we loaded the toner okay now i'm going to bend it i'm going to bring the camera close for you to see so with this printer this is the wi-fi button okay you can see a blue light right now is flashing it's for wi-fi network it's not yet connected and if it's connected it'll be a steady blue light this button here is information button this button here is resume this button here is cancel this button here is for you to turn this printer switch it on and off okay at the moment you can see we need to connect this printer to wi-fi network is what we're going to do but before we do that i also want to mention that this printer is with hp plus which give you extra one year guarantee with this printer so you have one year extra warranty making it two years and also six months of free 
ink toner to receive this service you need to register with hp instant ink.com the essence of it is you will never run out of ink or to and when the toner is running out they will send this to your home address automatically but it comes with the price plan so with the price plan it starts with one pound 99 euro depending on country reside here in uk one pound 99 could be uh, 129 pound okay per month and this one is six months free trial but you need to register with hp instant inc.com and you can also cancel this at any given time but myself i like to use pay as you go now what we want to do is for us to connect this printer to wi-fi network for us to connect this printer what we need to do is i need you to get your mobile device please and make sure you switch off your mobile data and turn on your wi-fi network make sure that your printer is connected to the same wi-fi network we are trying to connect right now so i have switched off my mobile data now i make sure that this printer my one by phone is connected to wi-fi network now what we need to do is um i do get a lot of questions people ask me where will you get the password for the wi-fi you get a password for the wi-fi from your internet provider so you need to find this information from your internet provider okay now what i want us to do is we need to go to play store so depending on mobile phone you are using so go to play store type hp smart app okay so this is already downloaded on my phone this is hp smart app download it on your mobile phone click it open so right now it's getting ready to open up okay here we go so this is the hp smart app is open give me one second so once you open it up the next thing you need to do is basically we need to look for this printer okay and with this app what you need to do is you can see a bell and a plus sign okay now so click on the plus sign and once you click on the plus sign the next thing you do is it will start to ask you choose the type of printer to add to hp smart app so if it's a printer this is a new printer so what we're going to do is set up a new printer okay but if it's already printer added already on the plan so then you need to add the one that's already added so what we're going to do is select a printer okay a new printer get started with a new printer now it's asking us once you select get started it asks you how do you want to connect this printer okay either with a tank cable or wi-fi network so we need to choose wi-fi okay and once you choose wi-fi click continue now the next is asking us get printer ready so make sure the printer is switched on on the flash surface then plug it in and power on connect your mobile device to your wi-fi network turn on nearby bluetooth permission and location precise location bluetooth on your mobile phone allow access when prompted hp smart app require this permission to find your printer so this is basically generating information you know you need to know things you need to do you know background things you need to allow bluetooth on and stuff like that so once you've done that the next thing you need to do is scroll up okay and click continue and once you click continue it will start to look for this printer right now this printer is found m290 laser jet is found already okay so i hope you can see it so what we need to do right now click on it so right now we need to put the password for this printer password for the network okay for the service product provider so i have this information here sometimes people do ask me where do you get the password so like i mentioned earlier you get the password for your mobile for your network for your service provider so i'm going to type up the password for this my office right now and for us to see make sure you type the correct details when you are doing this otherwise the printer will not connect this is also something i want to make sure that i let you know that you need to make sure that the details you are putting is correct and or else it will not work Okay, and once you're happy with the information you put, the next thing is click enter. 
okay click continue now it's asking us bluetooth is required to set up click continue okay now you ask us allow hp to enable bluetooth click allow so right now bluetooth is turning on and right now it's finding this printer so if the information we put is correct then it will find printer is found now the next step is preparing the printer So right now it's preparing the printer. Now it's asking us press the flashing information button on your printer for, sec for security we can find your proximity on your printer. So right now I'm going to show you, you can see the flashing information button is flashing. It's asking us right now you can see it. So what we need to do is just press it once. Okay. Which I've done right now. So right now it's preparing the printer. If the information we put is clear, printer is prepared. Right now it's obtaining an IP address. It's the next in line. So it's right now obtaining IP address for the network. And once IP address is obtained, then the printer will be connected to Wi-Fi network. And actually the blue light, from what I can see here, the blue light is connected. So this printer is connected to Wi-Fi. Here we go. This printer right now connected to Wi-Fi network. You can see it. You can see printer connected to Wi-Fi network. So and also I want to if you look over if you look right here, you see the steady blue light on. Like I mentioned, this was on from green to purple. Right now is blue. This is to show you that it's connected to Wi-Fi network. And also I uh, want to bring the camera close for you to see. If you bring the camera close, you will see this is the Wi-Fi light. It's now steady. It's no longer flashing. This is to show you that also printer is connected. It will show you this on the, on, on, on the, on the mobile phone. Okay. So the next thing to do is click continue. Okay. Now, right now, it's connecting to HP service. So it's connecting to HP service. Now it's asking us thank you for waiting. So right now it's connecting to HP service. Is the next in line the process is doing. So right now it's checking the printer status. So right now it's checking the okay connect to HP service click continue. Now you select your con language and country reside okay so English and the country is United Kingdom is what I'm going to select so you select your particular country. This is how to set this up. So right now what I'm looking is United Kingdom okay click continue. And once you select the country and con language and country click continue okay here we go introducing hp plus thank you for choosing hp plus so right now is for you if you are happy to for the benefit print from anywhere anytime 24 7 printer security remote monitoring mobile scan and fax file sharing Additional benefit six months of ink included additional one year HP warranty. Okay, so click continue Okay, now it's asking us By confirming you agree the following. Okay, so click continue So basically you need to create hp account okay for you to create you know put your details and for you to create account if you already have an account you just need to log in okay and put your details i already have hp account so i'm just gonna click continue okay so that this printer 
so you just need to sign in with HP account right now is connecting to HP account okay directing to HP smart in a few seconds so right now this is how it registered this printer so once you set up it will show you set up complete let's print okay so right now you can actually skip printing page okay then you see a link not right now okay here we go so basically this is how this here is this printer right now okay and this is how to connect this printer to wi-fi network thank you and stay blessed thank you